Howdy, y'all. Um, so today we're doing a triple review. I think I kind of want to establish what MAGA review means. Um, so MAGA review is, I'm going to go with four or more items being reviewed at once. Usually different types of items. You know, sometimes it's the same brand, sometimes it's not. Like, I did an Oreo mega review once, and then the other day I did Oreo, Skittles, M&M's, and Dove Candy. So it can change around a lot. So, uh, you know, I just think it's pretty cool to, like, change it up a bit. And, you know, I, it gets a review done, and I'm not, like, stressing over all these things that I have to review. Um, with that said... After this mega review, everything I've got left, like, other than, like, having to go to a couple restaurants, is, uh, cereal. So I'm gonna try and review that as many times in a week I can. But, you know, I can't eat a whole box of cereal myself, and I don't want to be opening so many boxes of cereal. So, uh, I already do have one that I opened, and it's not bad. But I know the review's not gonna be great because I saw that. The cereal gets pretty soggy pretty quickly so I will do like a taste test of it while it's dry so I can you know without the milk in it without all the distraction of it um, but uh I really would like to do a non food review pretty soon you know I want to differentiate myself you know have a variety of things to talk about I just got to get down what I'm going to talk about. Because I got a lot of things that go on my on it, in my mind. Um, not everything that goes on in this head is a bright thought. So, you know, I've got a lot of deep thoughts that go up in here that I can talk about. Because um, I'm really good at talking about these things. Um, but... For some reason, I'm not good at talking to everybody about these things, so, you know, I could just talk about it in general and just let y'all know who I am or what I think or maybe give y'all good advice. But anyways, that's that. Um, I was planning on a pretty short review today, but I think that little soapbox talk made this video a bit longer. Alright, so, uh, I'm gonna start with the Little Bites, uh, Strawberry yogurt muffin. I only saw them once. That's why I grabbed them. So, uh, I don't think they're around anymore. I wouldn't think they are. Um, and strawberry is more like a spring, summer, maybe even like Valentine's kind of flavor. This was out in the summer. And I was like, I'm intrigued. Who wouldn't be intrigued by a new, uh, Little Bites muffin? But yeah. I'm not going to say I recommend it or anything like that. I'm going to say, well, I would have said you should go get this. Or I would have said, no, don't do that. Or you didn't miss out, you know. But, uh, yeah, I don't know how I feel about the fact that it's called strawberry yogurt muffins. Um, I don't know if I should expect a bitterness in it. Or if I should just expect strawberry taste. Or not much of it at all. All I know is it is going to get a knock for the fact that I only saw it once. And, uh, you know, I want the public to be able to try these things. And they can't try them if, uh, they're not out at places. So, uh, well, yeah, this has the potential to be a bad review. But, you know what, could surprise me. You know what? It's not bad. You do get the strawberry taste. I think you get a little bit of that yogurty taste to it. Um, again, not the best muffin. Hmm. 
but pretty accurate, I would say. Um, I mean, it's got that bitterness in it. It's got strawberry. Uh, so, I would say, I give that um, a seven, just because knock a point off for not being available many places and it just coming out of nowhere. Um, I guess this flavor could have been a little bit stronger. But other than that, it wasn't bad. But, uh, yeah. If you do find them, go get them. Because if you like strawberry yogurt, that's got a little bit of strawberry yogurt taste in it. So, yeah. I am going to do this one last. I'm going to do the Pumpkin Delights cookies um, as my next review. Uh, so, uh, Little Debbie, nice little ginger lady, cooking up all the baked goods this time around. Um, so that was the summer flavor. These two are fall flavors. Cookie doesn't look too big. thought these things were going to be huge. I'm worried about that in terms of my health aspect. You know, I'm trying to eat healthier and, you know, be doing these mega reviews isn't quite good for my health. But, you know, I'm about done with those. And uh, for now, and I got just a couple more bad things, like super bad things to eat. Cause I know Arby's has so many good looking new things for me to try. A lot of people are like, why would you eat at Arby's? And I'm like, because their meat's pretty daggone good. And you know what? They got a pretty good limited edition shake every time they release one. And also, um, you know, all their food's pretty good. I don't, I don't get the hate on Arby's. Arby's is better than Burger King, better than McDonald's, um, definitely better than Subway. I would say better than Dairy Queen when it comes to food. Better than Sonic. Um, shoot, they're better than a lot of places. Um, I don't get the hate. I don't get why people are like, well, why does Arby's exist? Oh, they're better than KFC. They're better than Taco Bell. And Taco Bell's not bad either, but I think Arby's has the good meats. You know, we have the mates. Forget where's the beef. We're looking for all the meat. So yeah. Uh, smiley pumpkin cookie. I don't know if the cookie's supposed to be pumpkin or just the filling. But you know, as, as long as it has a good pumpkin sugar taste to it, that's what matters. Not really strong. Uh, to me, it tastes more like you know what you get out of like a not quite a gingerbread cookie. What's that other one that they be throwing around? Um, I don't know. It's not bad. But if it had more of a pumpkin spice taste and maybe some cream cheese frosting, it would be banger. Um, but, uh, I don't know. I'm a bit disappointed, actually. I'm gonna give it a four. I am sorry. There's my worst review so far. But you just don't get a great cookie. Um, I feel like Walmart makes just as good of like a sugar cookie probably. That's like that, you know. 
Um, you do get like a different taste, but it's not, it doesn't taste like pumpkin to me. Not too much like pumpkin. So I don't know, but uh, it was okay. But again, a four for just like disappointment. Uh, and that you can get like a cookie with that texture and that taste pretty much anywhere. Uh, and there's many other better cookies uh, than that. Okay, so my last three is uh, we got caramel apple oatmeal cream pies. I'm very intrigued by this. I hope y'all are intrigued by this. Hopefully, this will be the best one. Hopefully, it's way better than the stupid uh, pumpkin cookies. But we're going to have to say. And, uh, looks like a normal oatmeal pie. We don't want it to taste like a normal oatmeal pie, do we? No, we do not. So, here we go. Looking for apple caramel. Yep. I get that taste. Finally. And maybe on my second time trying an apple caramel flavored thing. I finally get that apple caramel I've been looking for. First one was a dove. Um, white chocolate. And it did not satisfy me one bit and I've had like three or four pieces of it. And it's not overly strong. But it's present. Right now, the fact that it's pretty good. It's got the taste it needs to have. I reckon I'm gonna give that a seven and a half. Cause I feel like it could have been a little bit stronger. And uh, the things are a little bit small. But that's just how oatmeal pies are these days. It's pretty much how most stacks are these days. You know, they used to be huge. Of course, I was probably like a toddler, five years old when they were big. And then, you know, when I started there, Getting to the ages where I would remember these things, for sure. The health regulators start getting in the way and telling them, you need to make smaller sized items. And the fact that inflation drives price up doesn't help with that. That they did that. And so, higher price, smaller portions, a bit disappointed with that but that's just life life ain't always gonna be easy I know for me it ain't I got my own issues I think snack size is really not one of them I prefer a smaller snack to be honest that's because it's my health and I'm eating these things so uh yeah I hope you like this review a little bit bogged down today Still got my cold. I'm gonna get through it. I'm at the end stages of that. But I got other things on my mind, so we don't worry about that. Unless y'all wanna hear it in another review, which is gonna come sooner or later. Um, but yeah, uh, all pretty okay. I mean, definitely wouldn't recommend the pumpkin cookies. I would say get the uh, caramel apple can't tell you anything about the strawberry yogurt uh, muffins because they're gone. But yeah, I just want y'all to leave a like, a comment, subscribe if you want to. 
even go on my Instagram or Dank Snack of Food that needs some some followers and some likes. But yeah, I hope y'all have a good day. I'm gonna try to do the same, but you never know with me.